Hello ladies and gentlemen, Mike here from Like Designs. Um, I'm using this program right here to record the actual like desktop stuff. Um, it's called Cam Studio and it's the best I can find right now due to Fraps not working for some reason. Like it won't monitor the Aero desktop. Um, the little frames counter doesn't appear up here or anything. Um, that was kind of weird what I just said. Um, yeah, and I also downloaded this other program called Take Screen Light, and I do not recommend it at all. Um, well, actually, sorry, I do recommend it for speed art or something like that because all it does whenever you actually record, the quality is decent, but it's like sped up at a, like a hundred times, a thousand seconds per second. I don't know. Um, yeah, so I just want to come in real quick. Um, Tell you guys something I'm working on a little cinema 4d project I call it the solar system um, I have all the planets uh, made it's not all the um, it's only the terrestrial planets the inner terrestrial planets including the Sun which is all the way back there uh, let's see let's render this real quick you'll see what it looks like there you go um, I did have stars but I found that it looks a bit better without the stars in the background and stuff like that um, like every single planet on here is made at um, the right size and everything. Uh, um, I, not the distance and stuff between each other. It's a little small scaled, but it does have um, like let's say including Mars. Um, it does have the bu the bump map and everything, and it's um, it looks very good. Uh, if you look around, you'll actually see, I forgot where I found it, Olympus Mons, which is somewhere around here. Um, but if you render this out, look, it has the bump map and everything. I also added the um, the atmosphere for it, and um, it looks very nice, looks very realistic. I did not have the, I, I didn't add the moon, though, for Mars. Mars moon, I did not add it. Um, didn't think I, I could have or should have. Um, hold on. Shit. Hold on. Screwing up a little bit with the camera here. Let's yeah, let's enable this right here. Okay. Now. Um I made Earth also. Here's Earth. Let's see where Earth. Okay, there we go. Earth also uh, it has its moon. Obviously moon the moon is right here. And as you can see it has it also has the the bump map. So if we render this out, you can't actually you can see it a little bit right here. Um Earth right here has the clouds and it also has bump map I added bump map just about every single terrestrial planet other than um, Venus because let's go to Venus real quick if you can see hold on let's find Venus Venus where are you where are you Venus okay um, there you are no wait yeah there you are okay let's go to Venus yeah let's select you alright Venus um, Without it rendered, it actually has the little thing. Um, but if I render it, the clouds appear, which is right on spot because the real life Venus, um, you can just rarely see through the clouds because this, the the atmosphere is so dense that um, you wouldn't be able to see through the clouds. So let's get rid of this atmosphere real quick. Uh, let's delete it, and then if I render it now, uh, you can see the actual ground but that wouldn't be realistic because real life Venus you can only see the atmosphere okay now Mercury was a bit of a small little challenge um, let's go to Mercury uh, come on come on zoom in faster okay it's not zoo hold on uh, okay, okay, okay. okay. Um, Mercury is a small little planet smallest in our solar system period um, it's about the size of our moon, and it's not at right color, I don't think so. I think it's a bit like more, I don't know. Um, but it was hard finding a little material for this, for um, Mercury. If we render this out, that's what it looks like. Hold on. Like that, it kind of looks like the moon, but it's not really, um, it's really small, just like the moon. Um, also made the sun, which is right here. It's a sphere. Um, I added a fog effect, um, making it the sun, so the light could peer out from the middle. Now, here's what it will look like if you're really close up. 
here's what it would look like if you're really far away very bright and there's the planets out there um yeah so i'm gonna be making some tutorials on how to make these planets and how to um, add the bump map to them and everything so yeah thanks for watching please rate and subscribe see how we stop this now a quick thing i want to say before people get um confused or something um the i did say that everything was at right scale and it pretty much is um, mars and earth are basically the same size um okay um this this program actually let me talk about the um, cam studio it's not good like i don't know what's up with it but it lags um when i was using fraps it wouldn't lag like barely at all um quick thing i want to say like I, like i was just saying the sun is not at right scale um the actual real sun in real life is a lot bigger um at scale the sun in real life would be shit about even a little bit probably a little bit bigger than that compared to the earth to anything uh, the sun is enormous enormous big okay let's render this out and the reason why i made it so small was because of this um, it wouldn't go along with the little re with the little um bright area right here, which I made the sun, which is a little light. Um, so that's why I didn't make the sun this big at scale. And if I did make it this big at scale, I would have to make the planets farther out there, and I wouldn't have had the patience to do that because I would just get lost in. Uh, in this program <laughs> just trying to do that so that was it that's all i wanted to say and thanks for watching like i said